Here we're going to look at question 23 from section 2 of the BMAT 2014 paper. So in this question, we're given the following decay. Uh, we're told that we have a uranium-235 um, nucleus, which collides with a neutron or has a neutron fired at it. Um, and then this causes a decay into barium, krypton and some more neutrons. So all the question asks us to do um, is to fill out the correct mass numbers of barium and krypton and to find the number of neutrons produced. Um, in our products. Um, so if you'd like to have a go at this question yourself, then please pause the video now. Um, otherwise, let's get on and have a go at it together. So in this question, we're actually not given much information at all. And it's probably worth thinking about the information which we have been given. So we know that we have a uranium-235 nucleus, which collides with a neutron. Um, so together, uh, well, basically what we've been told here is that uranium has an atomic mass of 235, and we know a neutron just has an atomic mass of 1. So, um, in total, our reactants are going to have a total mass of 236 uh, units. Now, if we were to look at our products, then there's one thing which we do actually know about them, and that is that their mass must be exactly the same. So this is just because there's going to be no mass being lost at all here, it's just going to be a conservation of mass uh, kind of situation, um, at least in this case. Um, which we can really assume because there's not actually any really other um, information we can get from this question at all. We've not been told any more. So we should really assume this. Um, and now since we know that, we know that the mass of these three things together is going to be 236 units. We can just look um, at the table of solutions we were given. And we can try and find out which of these are going to correspond to 236. And see if that eliminates any um, and makes our um, question a bit easier. So if we go through and add together the number of neutrons, the atomic mass of barium and krypton uh, in each row, then we get these totals here. So you, you should notice straight away that actually the only one which is going to correspond to our mass of 236 is answer E. So this is going to have to be our correct answer, um, since none of the other, ans in none of the other answers mass is conserved. Um, so our correct answer is just going to be E. Uh, that we have three neutrons, barium has an atomic mass of 141, and krypton has an atomic mass of 92.